um, I'm going to talk about this one thing here because we're going to go to financial markets as well as the financial backdrop. You can remember that I put this here and that it this is very important to have this household income, right? A couple other last details. You need to use exchanges in order to capture these amounts, whether that be your state has a state specific exchange, whether you're using the federal exchange, this links up to the federal exchange. The point is, in order to capture the APTC, you must use the exchange. You can go to the carrier site. They're going to ask you, do you want to check on savings? It's basically doing that in the background, right? So you need to buy, use an on exchange plan using the Affordable Care Act to capture the, the advanced premium tax credit. For more information on that, by the way, you see this article, yours truly here. My paper for Protected Alliance for Lifetime Income, right? You can read the full paper. Market update. I'm going to bring up to date on one issue here. This very important here, this mistake has to do with the next topic. Household income includes important stuff, which has to do with financial markets and year end planning, which is going to take the next half of today's broadcast. So let's first talk about year end planning. I'm going to change the order here. I'm going to move this here, right? So year end planning, let's do it now. And the reason I bring it up now is because what the mistake that occurs every single year, ask any CPA, is this is misreported, misestimated. And the reason for that is because why at year end, if you own securities, this also includes capital gains and dividend and interest taxes. If you receive dividends, interest, or capital gains, these are taxable events. And now you can see the crossover. Thank you so much to Mike C. Here. Therefore, ripple effect to here. It's the key point today. And now you can see the interactions because... What ends up happening is as a result of this, people lose track. People have gone to the wrong person, meaning by wrong, I mean the silo. And this is what I'm calling the silo effect, a phrase I've used many, many occasions. This is why the 10 minute video doesn't work, right? I realize that people want the answer, but if you get the reasoning wrong and one detail is missed, the answer becomes immediately wrong. Get me mistaken, which is the door can swing the other way. It means that the opportunity may have also been missed. It's just the other side of the same coin. It's just that the minus gets all the attention, right? But the plus also exists. I am not a David Downer. I'm not. I'm looking for opportunity for our client base. Opportunities as well. The thing that people miss here is capital gains and in creates this side has this situation and you can see inherently there can this can create problems and you'll see it here i have made this <coughs> right i have made this the topic of a video what 18 months ago two months two years ago two years ago which is that vanguard a targeted date fund and then therefore vanguard as the manager of it was subject to a lawsuit and you can see what ended up happening here. Here it is here, and I'm not gonna review the facts of the lawsuit itself. Complicated things. Your takeaways here, however, right, is that what? That what is overlooked are that mutual funds are ultimately black boxes, ultimately. I didn't say the people running them are dishonest. I'm not saying that they're, you know, underqualified. In fact, you know, it was, almost impossible, almost impossible that the person actually running the fund is incompetent. I just find that almost impossible, right? Just com competition alone tells you, again, use your common sense. The person inside there, right, is very, very likely very competent. If you want to see an example of it, you can see other interviews on Jay's Corner on the YouTube channel. I had a conversation with Ann Lester who used to run JP Morgan Retirement Services. Not incompetent, 
furthest thing from it. That said, the structure of mutual funds are ultimately black boxes. What that does is you are left, right, with this ripple effect of here. You're the one left with this. Van Vanguard may have done exactly what they were supposed to, or whoever's running your mutual funds in your holdings may have done exactly what they're supposed to, as mandated by their documents and justified and entirely within regulation. That, that is not the issue. The issue is the crossover that I just talked about, that lands on your desk, and that becomes your issue. Now, the reality is that this should be a year-round activity. And I'm going to give you some insight here, right? Inside here, over on the far right-hand side, and like I said, I'm just going to say without telling you what, the, what, because it hasn't yet been decided, we've got a few weeks, these prices are not going to sustain themselves here. You can lock them in before the end of the year, but my point here to you is that should be a year-round activity, meaning that these numbers, which can affect your taxable income, which will, as I've shown you, right, under health, under the quote of health, un, under the uh, quoting tool for individual health insurance. And now you can see how big it is. It's enormous. It's bigger than you spending time choosing between Vanguard, Ginny May, and Fidelity, Ginny May mutual fund way bigger, right? 15 grand a year, I promise you, these two line items with the same identical risk, basically very replicating for Bondoleros, right? We'll get to Bondoleros shortly. The marginal difference here of getting this wrong versus getting this right is not going to be anywhere close to this. No way. Think through yourself how big your portfolio must be to blow this off and to ignore this. And I promise you, the person with multi-millions of dollars, you know how they got there? They didn't overlook this detail. I, I promise you that. And if, if it was my responsibility and I overlooked it and that was the client, I would expect heat, lots of heat. And I would have earned it, right? I would have earned the blowback if I had overlooked this detail for a client as a result of the fact that I didn't understand how this worked. This is happening in every zip code, I promise. Some of the world knows this, meaning that this should be a year-round activity. The stable, I hijack from a different planet, right? The stable gets this service embedded. It's embedded in here, right? Over here. Because I realize that it's big and because it is ultimately a black box. So we need to watch what's going on inside to the greatest degree that we can. The reason that this becomes important is that now you can understand the fact that there are other technologies that are coming out in the world. There's this phrase called direct indexing. And let's just take a look here and I'm just going to show it to you right, to give you an idea. Custom indexing, you'll see lots of different articles. And in a day, in a day and age where artificial intelligence is everywhere, you know, the average uh, brokers and wealth management funds here are, or wealth management practices here are going to be looking at this and be pretty worry. So just like this, this is the AI answer, right? This is not professional financial advice. But can this direct index automated investment strategy then to replicate a stock index? And now you can understand Jay's corner when I'm talking about other ideas of finance, you know, I've used, I've tried to explain this idea, the key part of replication, right? Which boils down to, if I can make minestrone soup that tastes exactly the same for slightly cheaper, I do it. And in the same way, your specific situation make you allergic to oregano, right? You need to have that ingredient out of this minestrone soup, right? Because of your individual situation. Can you replicate with that tweak? The answer is yes. Can this be done automatically using artificial intelligence and algorithm? I don't see a barrier to it. Can you do this better than a human? This is the issue. The people who know that this is the case and I'm revealing it to you today are very unlikely to be pointing you to this. Why? because it could threaten their business. This is a, it's not gonna happen overnight. Can this threaten the entirety, the structure? Maybe. The flip side is, can this be deployed by yourself? No, I'm safe. I'm not directly unemployed immediately, right? Nor are money managers, because this won't be the complete answer, A. And B, again, like I was talking about health insurance, just randomly check 
choosing because they said they, they could do this, right? There's going to be 90. There aren't going to be 90 direct investing options. There are going to be 900. And one's going to be no oregano. One's going to be no basil. None's going to be no, not too much salt. One's going to be not, not too much pepper. There are going to be tons of variations of this. I don't need a crystal ball to know this, right? This is not me making some heroic prediction. But you can see replicated stock index, this is in, incomplete, can replicate a blank. This also means that in theory that you could replicate an entire portfolio. The answer to that is yes. And oh yeah, by the way, remember when I said oregano? Why don't I just tweak it to minimize my capital gains and dividend taxes? And then the result being I can then capture the maximum APTC. In other words, you may think it's natural, right? I mean, the, the, that's our planet. You may think I'm here to say, okay, this is bad. That's bad. They're here. They're ripping you off that they're ripping you off, etc. That That is not the case. It is simply that finding the optimal solution for you does require an understanding of the fact that all of these different topics here and many, many more, all these ones down here at the bottom, take a look. <laughs> I can't blow up, blow up the size. Annuity, fish, investment, savers, win. I mean, we're going to get to savers, win, but you can see it down here. This is, this is not the full set of factors that can affect. And if any single one of these changes, now all of a sudden your solution couldn't change, which can also mean early retirement is entirely possible. It's not only only that, oh, you know, what it is not, what it is not, it, it is not, okay, worth the tirade of something that cannot be done in the real world. It is not. How about we get back to work and think through the interactions instead?